go. Hi folks and welcome back to ENN Coins and Cards located here in beautiful Toledo, Ohio. Today we have a gigantic package back from PSA. We're going to pop this puppy open and see what we got. Uh, I know what's in here. Uh, 1970 basketball, which uh, we had a box, an original box come in. And uh, so we, uh, we pulled out the nicest ones that we thought and sent them in for grading. We're going to open it up and see how we did. Now this box is gigantic, but there's only 139 cards on the submission. So we'll, uh, we'll see how we did here. Now, as you know, the 1970 basketball cards are the oversized cards. The best rookies in there, you have uh, uh, Pete Maravich is the absolute best rookie card in there. And uh, Pat Riley's rookie cards in there also. Uh, we're gonna... Holy smokes. There are a lot of boxes. So I'm going to go ahead and just say it right now. This is going to be part one of a multi-part video so we can uh, get them uploaded. Okay, we're going to start with these four boxes here. And we got all these boxes left here. <laughs> so we're going to do this. We're going to break this up into a couple of parts here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start with this first, first batch here. And kind of get a feel for how we did. Let's see. Let's see. So I'm looking at the outside of this package here. And it says this is box nine of 12. All right, I'm pretty excited about this. Oh, we're starting off with a checklist here. Hmm, all right. So, we've got a checklist in seven. Another checklist, this one only got a six. Well, here we go, we got an eight on this one. We got a 19, we got a Guy Rogers in seven. Here we go, Earl the Pearl. We got a six on this one. Ooh, an eight on this one. A seven. Another seven. We got Bob Weiss here, we got an eight. Bob Rule, we got a six. Here we go. We got a Pat Riley here in seven. We got another Pat Riley. This one only five. Okay. So one decent, one not so decent. here uh oh we got some ones that they did not like here but we'll check them out and see what we got we got uh jerry lucas in a seven jerry lucas in a seven jerry lucas in a six Jerry Lucas in a 7.5. Another Jerry Lucas in a 6. Jack Marin in an 8. Okay. Lou Hudson in a 6. And a Connie Hawkins All-Star in a 7. 
And uh, we'll open these guys up and see who they didn't like in a few minutes here. Next box. All right. We have Bill Hewitt in a seven. Walt Wesley in an eight. Jim Davis in a seven. Tom Borwinkle in a seven. Paul Silas in a seven. Another Silas in a seven. Elvin Hayes in a six. Fred Foster in a six. Bill Bridges in an eight. And an Elvin Hayes in a seven. All right. Now the 1970 basketball are notoriously hard to get uh, high grades on, especially with as stingy as PSA is being now. Um, being that it was an oversized cards, oftentimes they were banged around some, but uh, these came right out of a box. Now, with that being said, I see this next card here. This is one I had from when I was a kid that I decided to send in with this lot. It's a Pete Maravich in a poor one. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's all of a poor one, that's for sure. But that's his rookie, and so I wanted to send it in because it had some sentimental value. The big O, Oscar Robinson. Oh, that one only got a five. Okay. We got uh, Willis Reed All-Star in a seven. We got a uh, checklist where the 7071 right here is in black in a seven. Rich Johnson in a seven. Mel Counts in a six. Rich Johnson in an eight. Walt Frazier in a seven. Archie Clark in a seven. We got Hoskett in a seven. That's, uh, that's his rookie there, I believe. Another Archie Clark in a seven. And another Jim Davis. We had one earlier here. Uh, and this one got a six. So that's part one of our video. Uh, we'll be opening the rest of the box here in just a minute, and uh, we'll be putting that up online for you. So uh, make sure you uh, hit that like and subscribe, and uh, it'll bring it up uh, as, as the video posts. We uh, really appreciate you tuning in. Thanks for spending a few minutes with us, and look for our next part to this video. Have a great day.